Hey guys, how's it going? It's Hassan here from Eshek, and today I'm bringing you a review of the Cyanogen Mod 14 Unstable Unofficial ROM for the Samsung Galaxy S5. This is for the Snapdragon versions only. So let's get right into the review. So guys, starting off, we have the general UI look and the special features for you so the lock screen aesthetically looks like practically any other nougat lock screen fingerprint scanner does work so i guess that is very good and we have the notification panel of course from android nougat because this is running android nougat and it just blends well with all the other elements of the ui like the multitasking array with those huge nougat cards now jumping into the settings, you can verify that this is indeed Android Nougat and the security patch is from October 5th, so it's not that old. And you have the split screen multitasking from Nougat of course, because this is Nougat. So I guess that is great, I love that feature. So now talking about the overall speed and stability of the ROM. The speed is like off the charts. The speed is absolutely phenomenal. There's absolutely no stuttering or lag to be seen anywhere in the UI. So I guess that is a great thing. And apps open relatively quickly and RAM management is excellent. Granted these are system apps but still this ROM is really really speedy. And does this have an adverse effect on battery life? We'll find out later in the video. But yeah, as far as speed is concerned, this ROM is the best you can get. I'm using the Google Pixel Launcher just because I like it and it fits in with the whole new good thing. And you have the app switching ability and memory consumption isn't too bad on this ROM either. But something that isn't the best is the battery life. The battery isn't really that well optimized so you won't be getting more than 3 to 3.5 three hours of screen on time. Now moving on to the worst parts of this ROM and there are the bugs and issues. So the first bug is the calling lag and I absolutely hate this. I have cut it up over here. It's actually longer than it appears in the video. It's like 20 seconds before the call is actually dialed and this is present in every nougat rom the orientation of the camera app is wrong and you can take photos but you can't open the gallery directly from the camera app also you can't record video so that's really bad now that we've looked at the rom completely i think it's safe to draw a conclusion let's move on to that so as uh, that was the cm40 normal samsung lx5 and yes, this is a good ROM overall, but the bugs are bothersome, so I wouldn't really recommend it. Like if you want to taste the new bit and you don't really call anyone or record video, go with it, but it's not for me. But yeah guys, that's been it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. And I'll try the next one.